we all know that Jared Fogel and Russell Taylor were very good friends and in fact Russell Taylor ran the Jarrett Foundation and the house that you now know you were being recorded in was Russell Taylor's home, correct? Correct. How did he seem? He seemed like a nice person, but as time progressed, it kind of got creepier and creepier. Describe creepy to me, and what's creepy mean to you? Um, like just, it's a weird feeling of something going on, but at the time, I didn't fully understand that. What did the three of you do there during the summer? We would mainly stay at the house. Um, we didn't go out much. The only time we did leave was to go to the liquor store where Russell took us. So obviously you couldn't buy liquor. Who was buying the liquor for you? Russell was buying liquor. So he was buying liquor and giving it to you? Yes. And what were you drinking? He bought us Smirnoff, beer. So I vodka think and beer? Yes, yes. Uh -huh. Did you guys drink to excess? I mean, did you get drunk? Yes. Did you pass out? We not didn't. remember what all happened, what, uh, what went on? I don't remember all that what happened, but I do remember being very, very intoxicated. Are you at all concerned of anything that may have happened when you were really drunk? Because you may or may not remember it? I am a little concerned, but I can only hope that nothing happened. I don't think anything happened. During the time that you were at this house during the summer, just in a normal course of things, there were times that you disrobed. You took showers. Yes. You changed clothes. Yes. You used the bathroom facilities. Yes. And you now know that what you thought was privacy was not private at all. 